As you know, we've always been the city of music in Liverpool. We're now officially UNESCO city of music, have been a couple of years. Uh, and this bloke is the man responsible for kind of taking that forward, head of UNESCO city of music, Kevin McManus. Yeah, that's it. So my role over the next few years is to try and take forward the city's music strategy. There's a few areas identified in the strategy and there's also uh, a new Liverpool City Region Music Board set up which is going to work, you know, I'll be working with them to take forward key areas. But it's, it's around things like making the most of our great music heritage, but also looking forward, supporting the best of their new talent. Look to protect the venues, you know, just make a, a great, a great, and sell the city as a music city, get people to come here because of the great live music, the venues, the festivals that we've got. How do we keep that momentum going? How do we keep nurturing local talent? I, th I mean, I think there's some great models out there. There's Lymph Academy's done some amazing stuff. Uh, some of the artists who've come out of there have, have gone on to do really good things. I mean, Sam Bolo signs and really going up there. There's people like Loon, they're not from their current crop. So there's there's things like that, and Bido Lito do their, their thing for young musicians as well, which is great. And we've got to make sure the venues are there, and we need to make sure promoters are getting supported. Obviously, we've lost venues like the Magnet, Constellations was, was a big story this year. What can we do to keep these kind of independent venues, keep them alive? I think one of the key things is uh, there's, a, there's a thing called Age to Change, which means uh, often in the past venues have been forced to close because... Um, residential uh, has been built next to them and then the venues have been forced out even though they were there in the first place whereas the agency change puts the, puts the owners back on to developers so they have to make they have to make provisions when they're building the, their apartments flats that to, to keep the noise out of them it's, so it's not the venue who suffers so hopefully we can take that forward across the city region listen you've got a big year ahead mate what are you looking forward to most in 2019 there's one really big thing coming up which i can't talk about Come as well you're not going to do that to us uh, kevin McManus. No, the obvious things like lymph and sound city and and, and fesh and um you know all, all the things that we're that we're all we all know happens there's the new event coming into there uh, the, like the 80s popping coming into crocky park we'll put full listings as to what we know so far we'll try and get some more info out of him very soon as well early 2019 but listen mate enjoy best Thank of you. luck you've got a big challenge and we'll catch up with you again next Thank year you.